Hello everyone. So my remake of the Raid on Bungling Bay is available for uh, playing on an open beta. Um, and I'm showing you uh, my version on the right and then the original version, Will Wright's version on the left, the original Commodore 64 version. Uh, Will Wright uh, eventually uh, went on to create SimCity and became very, very um, uh, successful. Um, and um, Here's the intro screen over here. And this game, his original game was 1984. So it's basically almost 40 years. And all of his uh, code uh, ran on the Commodore 64 and the overall game, the amount of bytes is 80K. And mine runs on like 10 megabytes. So uh, things have changed a lot. Okay, here's the gameplay differences. Uh, I'm showing you run it on uh, um, an uh, Android emulator on the right and then the original game. See this original game on the left over here? His, this is his demo mode. Uh, and then uh, my demo mode is on the right. I'm changing maps um, to show you all the different maps. But my uh, uh, demo AI actually tries to win the game and sometimes it does win the game. Um, so uh, if you don't know how to play or don't know about the original game, just click demo and actually show you the, the object of the game is just kill six factories. You have to bomb six factories and it's not as easy as that. It actually gets harder. But that's basically uh, uh, object of the game. And we're gonna transition into, uh, again, the full screen Android, uh, on Android here. And uh, the showing you the controls for a uh, mobile game. Uh, iOS is planned, but there's no point in doing iOS until I actually get feedback from the Android controls, because I, I did get some feedback. And for younger generation uh, people, they don't like the original joystick controls, which is if you push up, you speed up. And if you push back on the joystick, you slow down and left and right is turning. And it's not only slowing down, but going backwards. So how do you actually control the, um, the helicopter um, and make it go backwards? Because you know a lot of the feedback is, well, why don't you just put, touch the screen to tell it where to go? I go, well, how do you go backwards then? You know, do you, when you go, if you click back, uh, back behind the helicopter, do you turn around and then go toward it or what happens? And then they're like, oh yeah, I guess you're right. But anyways, uh, this is the whole reason why I'm, uh, you know, get people to play so to get some feedback and all that kind of, kind of thing. So I'm going to show you some screenshots now. Here is the original map on, uh, you know, showing the gray. This is the NES green. This is the secret bases there, by the way. It works. Here is bombing the uh, guided missile destroyer, not a battleship, guided missile destroyer. Oh, there's uh, high score rankings, high score service. It actually shows you. You could change the settings and the volume and the default map and make sure you protect your carrier, right? You make sure you go back and protect it. And that's basically it. I want to keep the video short. If you would like to play this game uh, or download the Android APK file or uh, the desktop version, which is a jar file that you're gonna need Java, you could go to itch.io and I will uh, link the URL to the itch site, my itch site, where it actually shows you where the game, and you could play the game and the download Android version and the desktop jar, which uh, allows you to make it work on Windows, Linux, and the Mac OS, as long as you have Java installed. And you could also play the game in, uh, on your browser. Uh, with the HTML5 version. Make sure hardware acceleration is turned on so that you could have all these great uh, shader effects in the background. And uh, you could um, play the game. You could uh, try to get a high score and save it on the global high scores service and uh, have a good time. So again, uh, three ways to play it. You could play it on itch.io using HTML browser, just a regular browser. or uh, you could um, download the Android APK, or you could download the desktop job. Thanks, and have a great one.